Cameron Smith Golf Swing Iron Keys. Big congratulations to Cameron Smith who won the Sony Open last week in the US. I want to talk about a few of the iron keys that he does that I've spoken about on this channel previously that make him such a tremendous ball striker that I know you can learn a lot from. Let's get stuck in. It's Troy from HittingItSolid.com here. At this channel, I teach you how to play the game of golf easy with at-home golf drills that lead to lasting improvement in the game of golf. Make sure you like this video. If this is your first visit to the channel, make sure you subscribe to the channel. More subscribers I get helps me grow the channel and keep on producing videos like this so we can both keep on improving and playing better golf together. Let's get started. As I said in the open, a big congratulations to Cameron Smith, who won the Sony o Open just recently. I want to talk about some really key iron keys that he does that make him such a great ball striker. So, one of the things that I really like that he does, and this is a move that's been fairly popularised in the last few years with uh, guys like Dustin Johnson and John Rahm, is this bowing at the top of the downswing. So, from down the line, I'll show you this view here. What Cameron does so well is when he gets to the top, you'll see his, his left wrist here, it bows like that straight away. And what that little move does there is it shallows the golf club very quickly at the start of the downswing and gets his club into a beautiful position. Now that position, if I get to the top here, that little bowing there, as soon as he does that, he gets that club splitting that right forearm, which is something I've spoken a lot about on the channel. So if we go to the top, that little bowing move he does there, flattens that shaft out and he's able to hit from the inside and hit a lot of solid golf shots. That's a real key move that he does. Another move that he does that I really like and all the top players do this, at the start of that downswing once again, he makes sure he moves his lower body first. This is something I've spoken about in one of my other videos and I'll pop that up above here somewhere and it's making sure as you go to the top, your very first move is that lower body twisting and, and opening up there. That lower body has got to move first. When you do that, it allows more room for your arms and your hands to get down and get into a great impact position. And Cameron does that super, super well. The other thing he does that's not often talked about very much is his arms especially in his downswing but even his backswing he keeps them pretty much the same distance until he gets passed through to his follow through so he keeps them about there keeps them fairly consistent all the way through he doesn't do he doesn't do anything like this where they get wide and they get wide through and past impact which leads to chicken wing and inconsistency he keeps them relatively that same space apart which is a big reason for his consistency. So it looks something like this. As he comes back, you see there, I've got that gap roughly the same again at the top. And as I come down, still about the same, through to impact. And it's not really till well past impact that that gap will actually change at all. So that really helps him become a consistent ball striker and the final thing I want to touch on that he does so well is he get that he gets that flat lead wrist at impact and a lot of that has to do with the way he moves that lower body first as he comes down he starts that lower body first but he gets down to here and he gets that wrist beautifully nice and flat he gets that forward shaft lean he gets in that really nice position here with those hips open and compressing the ball beautifully. And he, he also gets that shaft very parallel to the ground, right around that right thigh. There's a lot of amateurs, you might be someone that does this yourself. The club is down here somewhere, but he's got it up here somewhere. And he gets into that beautiful impact position that allows him to compress his irons and play a lot more consistent golf. In this next little part of the video, I'm gonna show you a really quick drill that's really gonna help you 
hit a lot more solid iron shots that will very much look very similar to what Cameron Smith does in his golf swing. So stick around, let's get into it. Okay, here's a really simple drill to help cement Cameron Smith's golf swing iron keys that I know will really help you out. I've used this numerous times before. You can practice this at home just doing short shots. You don't even have to be hitting a ball at all. Or you can take this to the driving range and hit full swings and really build yourself up to doing that. So you'll see here, I've just got a towel down on the ground. I've got a ball positioned about, I don't know, probably a couple of inches in front of that. And the idea is, I just want to do little short shots and try to hit that ball without hitting the towel. And what that will do, that will help you compress the ball, helps you get that forward shaft lean, that flat lead wrist, helps you get all of those good things that I was talking about in Cameron Smith's golf swing. So all I'm gonna demonstrate here is just with a little short chip shot. Obviously, once you get better at this with a short chip, you can build yourself up to doing full swings. And again, you don't have to be hitting a ball to be doing this. I could take this away take the ball away and just do full swings and practice trying to miss that towel. If I can miss that towel, it means I'm hitting the ball first and then the turf, and I'm gonna play some really good golf. So let's give one a try. Like I said, it's just gonna be a really short shot, but it's, it's tying in the principles that you need to do to hit solid iron shots, just like Cameron Smith. So here we go. Made pretty good contact. Just skim the tail on the way back, but I can press that ball really nicely. And that's a great drill you can practice at home to really get good at hitting solid iron shots, just like Cameron Smith does, and really lower your golf scores. Drop a comment down below if you've tried this drill to hit more solid iron shots. Maybe you've tried another drill that's really helped you out with your iron shots. Drop a comment down below. I will reply to every comment. So now you know Cameron Smith's golf swing iron key. So very important, up above this I'll have a couple of additional videos that are really important that you watch these. One will talk about the backswing, one will talk about the downswing, and that'll go into a bit more detail about these key moves that Cameron Smith does in his golf swing. Make sure you check those out. Now below the video I'll have a link to my three secret moves video. Make sure you click on that and get a hold of that. Also be a link to some further golf instruction that will really help you out. Make sure you check that out. Thanks again so much for watching. I'll see you next time.